welcome back to another episode of the new safe file. We're going to jump in again and I am going to play as the deleted this time around. Um, And I'm not sure what version of the deleted I want to play as. I want to play as a different one than the regular, but I I don't know. Let's let's just have a little look-see, see who we might want to play as. Um, We could go with Herodicamus or whatever they're called, the one that's really hard, that where you don't get any HP and you can only heal via taking negative effects. That one's like... He's tricky, but he is fun. Um, the challenge is, like, kind of nice. Also, light's reflecting into my room in a weird way and hitting my monitor, which, considering there's a wardrobe in the way, shouldn't really be possible, and I don't like it. Uh, right, so we've got I Love You, Red Hearts Only, Corrupted Items No Longer Have Negative Effects. That's kind of crazy. I Love You could be a... Do you know what? We'll, we'll, yeah, let's just, let's just do I Love You as a, as a, like, absolutely crazy run so it's, it's red hearts only obviously that's the downside we have charm tears by default but we have no negative effects on corrupted items so that's going to be rather wacky also golden bomb off the bat baby very nice very very nice i like it i love it i want some more of it but yeah i'm recording this extremely early for me wow that was, that was quite the dodge that i just performed there I'm recording this quite early for me. Uh, it's currently... Ooh, Soul Heart gets converted into Red Heart. Um, it's currently, like, before 9am, which is normally, like, way before I normally wake up, wake up. Get a ton of that and spawn 27 batteries. Fine. <laughs> oh, Lord. Oh, God, one of those was reflected. Excuse me. Okay, so let's hope we get an active here, because that would be pretty useful. Might as well bomb you as well, to be honest. See what we get. Little spider bros. But yeah, it's, it's very, very early. And it means that, I don't know, my commentary might not be the best. But due to unforeseen circumstances, and by unforeseen, i.e. me forgetting to do things in the correct time or place, um, I need to record a lot of videos today to make sure that I've got them ready for later in the week. Because I'm a stupid. But anyways, I'm here to enjoy myself. I wonder if having this many of this item actually increases um, my uh, chance of firing those shots or not. Probably not, right? Probably not. Um, take a pill. Bombs are key. Oh, that just gave us golden keys. Fuck you. <laughs> Didn't want golden keys. But this item is pretty good. The it's called time itself, right? Pretty decent. We do need some more HP. I can go back and get that red heart over there if I need to. I'm going to stick it out like this, though, and hope for the best. Oh, for God's sake, that enemy does that. Okay, so I may have made a mistake pretending that I could handle sticking it out. I'm going to need some help. I'm going to need some help. Right, who's left? Because it's, it's the Jumpy Jack boys, and they scare the hell out of me. Okay, it's just one of you, though. You still scare the hell out of me. Okay, let's go back and get some H HP that we've got lying around. Super sad I don't have golden bombs to find the second secret room slash kill the boss. That would have been very, very nice to uh, to do. And especially now that we're at the point where golden key is pointless. Bombs are key. Kind of screwed us a little bit there, but it's okay. As for the question of the day today, um... What's the most recent technological issue you've had, and how did you deal with it? Because sometimes it's just a good old punch the thing, or sometimes <laughs> you can do some pretty wacky stuff. For me, it's, I've, I've uh, for those of you that, that haven't seen yet, I have started a Skyrim series on my second channel. It might not be uploaded yet, but I've been recording it, and it is it is going well. It is good to go. Um, I do not like this situation. Uh, it's pretty good to go, so go check out my second channel and see if that's available. It's just chill playing Skyrim, but because it's heavily modded, there are numerous technical issues that I'm dealing with um, and had to deal with in the process of actually making the mod pack itself. Um, and it's, it's, it's going all right, but it is still, yeah, a little bit uh, a little bit difficult. There's been a crash here and a crash there and a few other various things that have happened. Uh, but I've been enjoying it a lot. Um, playing modded Skyrim is just a passion of mine, and having it on a YouTube channel just means I've got more reason to play it. And yeah, I've, I've, I've recorded like five parts of the series so far. I'm enjoying it. Five bombs at each boss kill, spawned three times Halo, spawned six times Pill. Three times Halo, but I didn't get the Halo item. Did, did it, 
this a hail of tears down? Are you fucking kidding me? Clairvoyance. Why so many tears downs? <laughs> Why so many tears downs? Why? That's so rude of you, game. That's so rude of you. Just a ton of tears downs. <laughs> oh, if there were tears ups, I'd be rolling in it, but sadly not. But yeah, so it means that I've been dealing with a lot um, in terms of trying to get Gungeon to work in the way I want, uh, Gungeon, Skyrim to work in the way I wanted to, which, yeah, not always the easiest, but it's mighty satisfying when you get a, a like, it, it does start working the way you want it to. Um, and for the most part, the series, like I said, is going pretty well. There's only a few minor technical issues. We had one crash so far, but otherwise, it's been pretty okay. Um, I'm a little worried with the HP I'm on at this point but it is it's quite I, I used to actually do a lot of early morning episodes like this it used to be more commonplace for me because i for one i used to like it as a way to sort of wake myself up ready for the work day um but also i used to be in a job where it was a little more necessary okay we're probably gonna die here it's kind of okay oh wait i lost all my time itself where did they go also why is that dip angled <laughs> what's happened to these dips these dips are all wonky Every kill, 5% chance to get, um, on item, two times webbing. I actually revealed this item, which is weird. I'll take that. I also got this. Delete it now. Oh, okay. Something has happened. It could. I think I want to take tooth and nail as it is. Okay, we've broken everything. Well, this was unexpected. Wait until we get this. I could take Molten Dime and get this going even more so, but... No, I will. The Molten Dime just drops. Things have gotten wacky. We got Ipecac now. Holy shit. <laughs> How did this happen? <laughs> what did I get? So many items over where I can't grab them. Why not spawn over here? Come on now. This is unfortunate. But anyways, let's take a bunch of items and then move on. Conjoin. Perfect. Oh lord. Um, I'm sure I have to take some damage to get back over here, aren't I? Got you. Dr. Fetus as well, why not? The bell clapper there, old oh, bell, whatever it's called. Thank you. It's actually spawned some items on the spikes. Okay. Um... I don't really know... What else I want? Scapula's good. This is so crazy. Why is there no music in here as well? Oh god, I took soy milk. I didn't mean to take soy milk. Look at all the cool stuff over there that I can't get. There's my reflection and everything. I'd love that. What I'm looking for really is bomb immunity. That's what I really need to make this pop off. Once we get bomb immunity, we're all good. <laughs> uh, of course, I could actually bit flip all of these as well. Um, Eternal card. 
Parasite seems mighty dangerous. Looks like it anyways. Ludo. How does Ludo work with this cell? I don't even know. Parasitoid tears, I'll take that. Oh my god. It's getting slightly unmanageable. We've got Biel oh, we, we got Beelzebub, we've got Flight. Okay, we can actually get over there now. Golden Sulfuric Acid. Sci-Fly. Don't know what Chocolate Milk does for us, but I'm going to take it. I'm trying to see what in here is, like, good for us. Getting unmanageable. Um, Daddy Long Legs, Tech Point Five, You Listen, Don't Want the Mark. Oh no, no, I've got myself stuck. I can't be stuck because otherwise it'll take my reflection and that would be terrible. Okay, good, we're out. Let's take that. The leech. The golden bomb there now. My god. This has become something quite... Quite crazy. Apple. I just got, like, the best synergy possible to just absolutely destroy this run. Trying to get over to the B uh, to the 3D glasses. There you go. We also got vanilla wafer there, which I'd kind of like. The problem now is like actually finding a way to get out of here without taking a ton more items. Oh shit! I just took scatter bombs. Okay, we really need explosive immunity. Like right the hell now. Ooh, Soul Cleaver could be funny. <laughs> Soul Cleaver could be very funny, although that would take every item, including my reflection. Um, what else do we have in here? Let me try and get, like, somewhere over here. <laughs> oh my god, this has become so crazy. Okay, I think I'm gonna have to leave now. Uh, I want, I want this first. Let's leave. Right, let's first fire our shot and see what happens. Okay. Well, this was unexpected. I'm probably gonna die. I need explosive immunity. Let me back in the room. I can't even move. I literally can't even move. There's nothing I can do. What the hell's causing this? Like, I, I literally can't move. Like, th this is all just the inertia. Like, I, I need to leave the room, but I, I literally can't. Like, I seem to be able to move around, but I'm not sure where the constant brimstones are coming from, I'll be honest. So let me, let me in the door, please. Of any door. I can't get in anywhere. Well, that was a fun ride. <laughs> I, what what the hell caused this? Like, I realize I have a fuckload of items, but what, what's causing the brimstones? I don't have brimstone or anything of the kind. I think it's the 3D glasses, maybe? There was health in there as well that my game just wouldn't let me pick up. Well, anyways, that was fun. <laughs> okay, let's let's try again, shall we?
Yeah, don't pick up the 3D glasses. They break everything. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that was 3D glasses. That's the only thing I know of that can give brimstone that we had there. It's not meant to give brimstone, mind you, but it was. Um, and it for some reason created an infinite. I knew I needed to get explosive immunity, but it was just, just taking too long. And I got bored. Didn't think I'd be instantly dead, though, I'll be honest. Didn't think it'd be a an infinite sort of thing. I thought it'd fire it, it'd do a few things, and then it'd be over. But no, the 3D glasses, they broke everything. Sometimes with deleted, you get too greedy. You find some cool synergy, and you go over the top. Um, for nine golden batteries... Nice, I guess. Okay. We got quite a few items already. Thought we were going to go infinite straight away there, but we are not. Oh, God. We got the anal beads. Oh, he ate them. He ate the anal beads. That's crazy, guy. That's crazy. You're not supposed to eat those. I will take said pill. Ah, really? Just bad gas. I'm hoping I don't die here, because yet again... On low HP. This active is actually not bad for us, though. We can eat up... In fact, we could probably eat up all the uh, the golden batteries, thinking about it, and get a bunch of burn fragments. I'm going to try that, actually. Oh, really, I absolutely hate this enemy. This enemy can be fine sometimes. Other times, it's like it poops out a thousand of these things, and it just makes everything more difficult. All right, let me quickly go... Yeah, I'll take Ringworm. Let me quickly go back over here and see if this works on the golden batteries because it might do and if it does it'll give us a bunch of burn fragments yeah there you go look hey there's hp as well oh i have been turned into the lost upon um picking up a heart not exactly sure why um it doesn't say anything in here either i've been given this white fi uh, white fire item and I'm now the Lost. Which, yeah, it's kind of spooky. I don't know how long that'll last for. I don't know what else this White Fire item does for us. I don't know if it does anything positive for us at all. But I guess we'll find out. Okay. We've, we've set up something rather intriguing here. This guy can actually be really bad for the Lost. Because he does some sp pretty sporadic jumps and all the spiders don't help. We do have a bomb if we need it. Rather than not use it on this guy though. We do have flight, which means we can't get slowed down by his creep, which is nice. Bomb ringworm. Work with me here. Just took it for the fire rate right, mainly. Um 14 kills, get a temporary, whatever the hell that is. Yeah, we'll take it. Yeah, so I might just be permanently the lost now. I don't really know. <laughs> I guess we just gotta sit and find out. Whoa, there's a phone call. Oh, hello. I'm firing out numbers now. I was for at least a rune. It seems that we're just permanently the lost now. Fine by me, I guess. Fine by me, it makes the run even more wackier. Ooh, what's this little guy in the middle? Is he new? I think he's new. I think he got added with the boiler update. And, uh, because I saw him on the boiler floor, but I think they've added some default ones of him to the regular downpour, too. That's cool. I like these enemies. They're really, really unique. Goddamn, shoot things out of that goddamn head. You do gotta be kind of careful for them, though. They, they tend to leave quite the splash. It's a little bit scary. Okay. We can sit up rocks and stuff, which is good. At least it gave us flight. Oh, hello. Um, Reroll a single item or pick up. Um, only lasts for the current room, doesn't it? The current room is spawned in. It's kind of pointless for the most part, but we might be able to get some use out of it down the line. Okay. Keys. Oh, keys spawn pooters. I forgot about that. 
go back to our item room real quick, see what we can get. Yeah, this has already become a fairly wacky run. Did get nugget bombs. Um, on hit 2%, that's not very good. We'll take whatever this is. We have literally no idea what that was, so... Good luck to me, I guess. That could be all sorts. I mean, it's got no negative to it, but that doesn't mean that it can't be bad. Just because it has no stated negative. Some things that are pretending to be positive are definitely negative. So we'll, we'll, we'll see what sort of um, what sort of crazy stuff that did for us. Managed to do a good amount of damage to him there. Try and keep him in this pool. Oh god, he hit me. A bad play on my behalf there. Don't get killed by the leeches. They are all good. 51% chance to use a pill each room. That's pretty good. Um, each room, 75% chance to spawn four throwable bombs. Every kill, 78% chance to spawn to summon a whirlpool. I don't know what a whirlpool is. I'm going to take that one, though. A whirlpool. I'm interested to see what that ends up being. Anyways, we've got a lot of money now. We're going to be getting six coins every room. Don't like that noise. We get some throwable bombs as well. Which is probably going to be more inconvenient than anything. Okay, it literally is a random whirlpool. It doesn't look to do anything, sadly. Seems to be purely visual. Which is a shame, because I was really hoping with it being a whirlpool, it would be something kind of useful to us. But it seems to be purely visual. Again, it's kind of a shame. That didn't really work. I was hoping I could get a bomb over and kill these guys, but I can't quite get it far enough. Yeah, it's just like visual whirlpools everywhere now. I mean, yeah, I guess. <laughs> Not terrible for us. So how does this, if I use this here, eh, reasonably good. Also, one interesting thing now is I have a good target to use my active on to get burn fragments regularly. So I'm going to be getting pennies every room and I certainly aren't going to need the pennies every room. These whirlpools are actually a little bit visually distracting, but more fool me, I guess. Yeah. Golden troll bomb. Why? Why golden troll bomb? Why would you do this? Like come in here and just pop that. Gives us a bunch of burn fragments. It means we've like got that extra added protection considering we're the lost now, which is rather nice. Oh, I found a secret room completely by accident there. A bit of money down here. Oh, you hit my burn fragments? Oh no. What am I ever gonna do? God damn, so much money. Check what's in here. We need something that's gonna up our damage, really. Um, That doesn't do anything for us. Sad times. Getting an empty heart container. Don't think it's really gonna push the boat out for us too much. At least the whirlpools are thematic on these floors, but later on they're going to look weird. I mean, they already look a bit weird, the fact that they're pink. And that's just because I have my shots are pink there. Good. Check what's in the shop first. Summon two Hemo Trail. Spawn six cards. I'll just take that. Moon. Um, Moon, Empress. Okay, we'll just take the Glass D6 here. And the Luck Upgrade there is rather nice. Bit Flip. Um, each boss kill, 
get the the poop book. Each boss room get soy milk until hit. Let's um glass d6 this. I'm actually just gonna, just gonna take this item for what it is. A regular item. How crazy of me, I know. There's also a look penny in here, apparently, too. Oh, really? It needs to be bombed again? I always forget that. That's very annoying. Also, this coin is annoying me. Stop getting stuck there. Right, back we go. Yeah, this has been a bit of a weird one. Bit of a weird one. You for all the burn fragments. Good thing here is we actually have some free use bombs to uh, take this guy out with. Wow, okay, they, they were very useful for the boss room. We get perfection. Great stuff. Um... I can re-roll this into speed and shot speed. Not great, but I'll take it. Right, let's get gone. Okay, this, this run's reasonable right now. Oh, we have... I was about to say we have real health now. We don't. We have real health for a hot minute and then it disappeared. Why have I revealed this man? Why have I decided to let this guy into the wide, wide world and using his attacks? Don't like that. Okay. Anything in here for us? Not really. Okay, I can't just bomb and destroy everything though. That's nice. I have so much money. That one gave me nothing. How dare you? Okay, we're just hoping for good shops and item rooms real realistically now. Nice. I really like the extra bombs we're getting. They're a bit risky, but very nice. Oh my god, the fucking bombs. Get off me. Spawn a tinted rock. Didn't even spawn a tinted rock, that's a tinted rock. Or did, did it say tinted rock? It might have said tinted rock. I don't remember. Right, not a great item. Come on, game. We also got these bricks in our inventory now. I don't know where they came from. Take out the bomb flies. If I can. I'm trying to, but I missed them in every opportunity I had. Bring on the whirlpools. They'll do so much for us. Honestly, yeah, this this, this makes rooms a lot easier. I don't know if there's a limit to how many burn fragments I can have, but I've got a lot already. This is a very annoying room. Mainly due to the fact that these goddamn little fellas are blocking my bombs. This is actually a really gross room. I'm not completing this room. This room's going to take us forever with the damage we have. No thank you, buddy. No thank you. I am not completing this. There's just so much shit to fire at. I will just skip you entirely. You would take forever to get through. I don't want that. This is the first room we've not had pennies or bombs this entire floor. Kind of crazy. We just need more fire rate or damage. We've got none of that so far. Would be very, very nice to get some stat ups. Um... First hit each room. Wow. Use teleporter. Really, it's teleporting me back this way now. Okay. 
don't want to do your room. Room's like, it's just too busy. It's too much going on. Way too many enemies. Like, calm the hell down. So much money still. And that shop was kind of poo-poo as well. Good, good. How did that kill no one? Come on now. Ah, oh, I got a secret room there. Nice. Secret room could be more items, could be more stuff. Yeah, we've just not really had that, that one thing that clicks yet, have we? We need that one thing that just goes hard and we've not really had it yet. That's potentially good. It just gave me a tears up upon picking it up. But now if I use this, I get stabbed, but I do get a speed down. Okay, so each use of my active, I'm going to get a damage up, speed down. Which is scary, because that could go very wrong. I'm also intrigued by it. Nice. Flies, I don't care isn't it, to know you. Oh god, yeah. Down to very low speed now. Our speed can get lower than this as well, can't it? Oh, so we've got pinchy cramps in the business. I don't care for them. But at least we got some damage now. I'm okay to sit the speed down. And we've actually got some damage going on. Really? That only killed one of you? Haha, I charmed you. None of that really does much for me. A rotten heart? Does, rotten heart, does a rotten heart work for us? Yeah, our speed is hella low now, but our damage is getting up there. I thought charming those guys would help, but sadly not really. Oh god, the speed is going to be our downfall here, isn't it? In fact, I don't even really know how this boss works. He's been changed, and I, I, yeah, I really don't have a good grasp on how. I know some of his attacks, but not many. Really? Okay, actually, that's still hit him good. I was going to say, that would that would have been really annoying timing if that had missed completely. Like, he's doing all this crazy stuff, and I'm just not ready for it. He's going to, like, do a brimstone at some point. I think this guy is a champion version of himself, though. He's going to end up doing, like, a brimstone something or other at some point. I'm going to be scared. After two hits, get a black heart. Uh, I think we just take this for the damage. Really? Like, why are our goddamn, like, items so bad? Like, so, so bad. Like, that is terrible. It's absolutely terrible. Why on earth is it that bad? But yeah, with every active use, we get slower and slower. And we get more and more damage. Kind of a double-edged sword at the minute. A double-edged sword I'm willing to, uh... Willing to try out. Siren's Call's pretty good. Spawn 14 Falling Ember. On... You 70% chance to spawn 4 Confessionals. Okay, that's not very good. Let's just take the actual item then. The actual item is better than nothing. Better than spawning confessionals, which I can't really use. I can't believe my Rotten Heart actually works. More speed down. Keep this train rolling. Hopefully find the item room soonish. Yeah, don't know how this run's going to go, especially considering the fact that we currently have, um, we currently have, like, we're currently the lost. That definitely scares me. But the burn fragments are, like, just keeping us so set right now. Oh, we need keys really badly, I just realised. Thank you. Touching your shopkeeper will allow you to hire them for 15 coins. Uh, get whatever that is. Each boss kill spawn four cards. Yeah, let's take that. Um, take that. Let's 
Where is that item room? Probably not this way, but I'll, I'll keep going this way anyways. Oh god, this enemy is so annoying. It just spawns so many spiders. Downright rude how many spiders it spawns. Right, we're, we're at the minimum speed I'm willing to go to now. Do the boss. Oh, it's this guy. I think this guy's actually not so bad if you have flight, so we should be okay. Because, like, his main gimmick is this attack, but this attack doesn't really affect us. Please just stop once the fight's over. Um, every kill spawn... Oh, my God. Every kill, 29% chance to get one spider. Okay, that's pretty good. Queen of love. Bombs. Calling card. Calling card. Um, take out these first. We got an arm. Swing an arm in the direction you're firing or moving. The arm can parry enemies' projectiles with a tight uh, timing. Boost your own tears. Reflect. That's kind of interesting. Don't think I'm going to use it right now, though. On hit, 1% chance to spawn 5 keys every 7 minutes. Get a tiny, tiny, tiny amount of speed. Okay, unfortunately, yet again, kind of useless. Yeah, I want to go to my item room, but I've just used my active again. Not thinking. And now I've got to do it with 0.2 speed. This is going to take a while. We need more speed-ups. Oh lord. Sai Hunter boy, just just, just walk there for me. You can move a little quicker than I can. <coughs> Sorry about that, I got a tickle in my throat. I had to pause real quick. Right, check over here. Sai Hunter guy is going to do everything for me for a little while here. Because I am incapable... Moving around at a reasonable speed. Hey, there you go. Nice one. He does actually have a really good job of killing stuff, to be honest. So, no threat in that department. And we did find our item room, too. Beautiful. Oh, dude. Dude, these items are so garbage. Where's my item that gives me infinite items? Come on now. Items we're getting this time around are just not good. <laughs> and like, even the items themselves are not that good, so we can't even take them unflipped and be happy. Oh, right. This is so slow. Maybe I ought to only use this once or twice, because it's uh, pretty painful to move around with 0.2 speed. Criminal that it can even go this low. 0.5 should be the lowest limit of speed. Right, down we go. But yeah, this is going to all come crashing down pretty quickly with us being the loss, but we'll see. Thank you, Psy Hunter boy, for killing everything for me. It's very nice, actually. Really ducked under that? Get over here, you. Right. We're probably only going to use that, our active one more time. Maybe not even one more. Thank you. Like, it's just not, not great at all. I'm going to just take the item as it is, I think. Trail can be kind of good. Enemies can start some infighting. Not a bad thing for us. Come on, shop our arcade. Please be good to us. This could be good. You guys tend to pay out when I'm not playing as Mammon, so... Like, as I said, tend to pay out when I'm not playing as Mammon, so nice. Come on, guy. Don't be a shit. Oh, speed up. Yes. Don't be a shit, come on. Don't give me flies and spiders, it's not okay. There you go. 
But on 18 grab bags, it's not very good. I'll just take the cactus itself. Um, yeah, I'll take that too. <clears throat> okay, that was not terrible. Get five times boomerang. Uh, get whatever that is. Upon next floor, use that. Try that out, shall we? Oh, we got a lot of boomerangs here. Okay. Okay. We now just have the boomerang. Does using the boomerang do anything for us? We can't turn things to burn fragments anymore, which is not great. Don't like a prospect of that. Each boss kill, 25% chance to spawn pills, spawn 3x fireworks. Okay, that was... Fireworks are pretty useless there, I guess. We're killing stuff reasonably quickly, though. We got some... Oh, Dude, sculpting clay. It's always here when I'm down. It's always here to... to, to, to to rise me up. Instead of dying once, 1% 1 chance. Okay, we, we also spawned four trinkets. Pretty terrible. Anyways, molding clay is. It's coming up very, very often at the moment, but it is like one of the best items ever. It's so damn good. Because now we can corrupt an item and get a real version of it at the same time, which is pretty awesome. Okay. Now we're just trying to actually finish the floor. Who knows how long that'll take. Beautiful. These thrown bombs are just beautiful. So many keys. Take a good few of them. We don't need to take all of them though. Oh god, we got so many spiders as well. I forgot that we were getting spiders for every kill. Um, or, or like, tw it's like a cer certain chance for a spider pair kill at least. Oh, we have Herming now, apparently. I'm not going to complain about Herming. Nice. Do we have, oh, I think we have permanent Herming now. <clears throat> we also have a, a bunch of these lust Lusty Luds or whatever the hell they're called. I can't remember what the hell these ones are. Lust I think this is Lusty Blood. Normal Lusty Blood, not Bloody Lust or what. I don't, I don't remember. Bloody lust. I, it's one of them. That makes you a lot easier. Oh, really? You jumped? Heck you, buddy. Heck you. What the hell's our boss room? Oh shit, it's just the guy in the middle, I see. Ah! I've finally been hit on my holy mantle. Be careful. That was scary. Oh, Bulga was holding a bomb. I didn't even realize. <laughs> okay, we're on to mum. I've lost my holy mantle because I decided to stand somewhere really stupid. Gotta be careful, this could be the end for us if we're not vigilant here. This one's kind of in a crap fest. We got it though. We'll take the negative, I guess. Got a lot of cards there. Chaos disc, I guess. Puzzle piece. Rerolls items in the room into items from the devil pool. Small chance to convert items in the room into holy or devil themed heart chests. Misprinted Joker. Misprinted Joker. Misprinted Joker. Wow, we got a lot of misprinted Jokers. Queen of Diamonds. Of diamonds. Tears up. Tears up. Two of clubs. Of clubs. Three random hearts. I didn't even use my molding clear this floor, god damn it. Anyways, let's go. Oh my god, we got some damage. And we are alive, at least for now. We've also got a lot of rotten hearts, which is pretty helpful. 
We're firing rock tiers now. Don't know what's happening, man. Cannot break walls, though. Here we've got that as well. Nice. It's so confusing. This run's just become something really weird. Oh, we're hitting enemies back full of poop. We're generating a lot of shit right now. Which could be a really good thing. I don't know. Oh, with petrified poop, it could be even better, but... Can I really drop perfection with petrified poop? I don't think that's a great idea. Oh, where the hell did this come from? Question mark card seems really good. Fucking give me the card I want. Oh my god. Fucking stop. Thank you. I can definitely tell it's early because this is this is mighty confusing to me. Still don't know where the hell I got Herming from. Hard to know with these runs. Got Turk in there as well. Just try our best to keep it going. How is this room not over? Okay, there you go. Oh my god. That's a lot of boys. We've also apparently got a wacky stick. I whacked that guy. You're like close range whacking. I bring it close to someone, I do a melee swing. Just making things even more confusing for myself, though. you aware. Osh room. Good, good, good. Pooping on everything. Bunch of whirlpools going on for us. The goddamn blurt. No thank you, blurt. We need to sit somewhere more agreeable to us. At least we're knocking him down to the bottom of the screen, that helps. Puzzle piece. Okay. Oh, for fuck! Oh, I'm getting so frustrated at this goddamn game! Give me some good items, please! Oh, why did I explode there? Was I holding a bomb? Must have been. Every 20 seconds, 60% chance to get one flaming turd. Oh god. I think I just want to go... Question mark card. Oh, the question mark card actually used my active. That's not how that's meant to work. Anyways. <laughs> I thought I'd be able to get an extra use out of it, but I guess not. I guess not. One second. Okay, let's keep this pain trainer moving. Keep this pain trainer moving. We have nice shot speed now. I've buffed my shot speed a lot. Just yeah, just we still don't have anything crazy. It's 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 so mad. It's like so funny that like that first run was absolutely broken, and I just I just died because I got too greedy. I, to be fair, I also accidentally took scatter bombs, which probably didn't help the uh, situation. Scatter bombs probably didn't add anything good to the mix. Boss room, where are you? Where are you? Where are thou? Is what I meant to say, but I just said, where are you? Where are you? They also mean. Taken the hell out. What the hell? What is this? It's trying to knock him back constantly, but it can't. 
Little attack boy. Puzzle piece. Dead bird. Oh my god. Okay, well at least we get these daggers now. I think it said until hit as well. All these until hit things work really well for us because we ain't getting hit. <sighs> Gotta be getting close to the boss. Oh, one of those little shop things. We got a lot of money, so they're pretty valuable. Quickly check that out. See, these is what fucked us over before. Um, I think we duplicate one, and then buy the other. The damager, or we'll buy that as well. Oh, I I bought the the reversed version. I have no idea what the reverse version, the tainted version, whatever glitch version did. I just took it, so that that could be terrible for us. Who knows? We are running into each other like madmen. It's a really annoying room. Big bodies won't get out of the way. Okay. We got a lucky penny here as well. Nice. Damn, that's a long that long ass boy. I did get hit there, apparently. Oh my god, we got like his tail stuck behind the poop. Okay. Boss time. Oh, I lost my holy mantle there, apparently. I don't really know how to, how or what to, but I did. Try and utilize my bombs where I can, but it's not super plausible to do that constantly. Okay, we're good. And what did we take again? I don't remember. I think we took the negative right, I guess. I don't really remember. At least we got a lot of rotten hearts going on, so we get a lot of flies per room. That helps. Alright, keep it moving. I can't believe we're still alive, honestly. The fact this run's still going is kind of a miracle. That room kind of cleared itself out for us. More luck pennies. We have 15 luck now. Grab that real quick. Oh god! Didn't see that guy under the ground there. Rather not tango with you, fella. This goddamn guy. Oh, for God's sake. I might die to this guy. This guy is the bane of my existence. Oh! I didn't die. Confusing. Oh, I did die there, though. Damn it, that guy's so difficult. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this absolute clusterfuck. It was interesting, to say the least, and yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one.